Hi, this is Jennifer from Positively Learning, and today we're going to play a game. We're going to be playing one of the Google Slide games that um, come from the bundle that set up your calendar for the entire school year. So here's a picture of the bundle. There are 36 games, one game for every week of the school year, so 36 weeks. So all you would need to do is open up the game and you're ready to play in your small reading groups or your independent centers. So when you purchase the bundle, you're actually going to get a PDF. So I've opened it here and the PDF shows you a closer look at the games. And on this page, the second page, you see a table of contents. So the skills that are on the left hand column follow a scope and sequence for phonemic awareness and phonics. It really is perfect for pre-K and kindergarten. And then it moves through first grade skills and it even moves up to second grade as you look down here and you see the vowel diphthongs and soft C, soft G and so on. So if you are working with a mixed skills group, um, which is what I usually had in my resource room, you can find something that's going to be just right for all of your students. Now, each skill is available in a holiday or seasonal and a non-holiday, a theme that can be used all year. So that really makes it easy for you to do your planning. So depending on what time of year, you can either choose the holiday or you can choose something that everyone's gonna enjoy. So for example, if you are working on rhyming, phonemic awareness, there is a Halloween version and there's a Bubbles version. So the Bubbles can definitely, definitely be used anytime. All right, so in this download, you also see the directions. Um, every game has 25 questions. So if you get the whole bundle, that's like 900 questions. And they all follow the same routine. There's five different styles of questions, and that's what we're going to be looking at today. The next page is the clickable links. And what's cool about this is all you need to do is keep this PDF. When you click on a, any of these covers, it will open up the game and it'll be ready to play. So you don't have to download the game, upload the game, anything like that. You just click and play. That's it. All right, so now we have to decide which one are we gonna do today that together. How about the superheroes? So I'm gonna click on the superheroes. Where is it? There it is. Superheroes is a Val team. So just keep that in mind that these are all the these are all different skills. I'm just choosing the Val team one to show you. So I'm going to click on that cover and it's going to open up and be ready to play. So your students are ready. Just tap here to start. Okay. Now, the first few questions, actually, first five questions, follow a very distinct pattern. And that is on purpose. This pattern, the first five, are what I use for a quick data point, whether it's informal pre-assessment or just like progress monitoring. So this one is Val Teams. So the question asks, what are the missing letters? So you can tell what kind of what the word's gonna be because of what is already provided, but you're focusing on the Val Team. Tap the mask to check your work. So this one is missing the E-A, that gives us the long E sound. I'm tapping the mask and there it is. So these are just self-checking. We have the long I spelling, hitting next, mail, stew, the long U, and that's it. The rest, the next set of questions is where you have multiple choice. So you are clicking on the word with the right answer. So naming the picture, finding the word. So we know this is braid and notice that the other choices are a purpose to kind of trip you up, but those, those do not have long vowel um, sounds. So hopefully your students are gonna know that and I'm gonna click braid. The next one, I'm going to click one that is not correct, just to show you what it looks like. So I'm going to choose grow. And that's what your students will see. Try again. Cry. And the next one, clue. Okay, here's what the next set of questions looks like. It is very similar. Your students are naming the picture, finding the word, but they just get a little bit of a different um, fun. Fun at addition, the correct superhero is gonna fly. So this girl is showing us the word play. And B, the superhero flies. 
and snow. Okay. Next set of questions is going to be solving a puzzle. Now, this is really important to know. It says every correct answer helps you solve the puzzle, but be careful, a incorrect answer will take you back to the start. That is important to note. Okay, so finding the word soap. And you can see the puzzle starting to change. Dream, juice, pie, and road. So it does a really good job of like making the answers very random, whether they're where the answers are placed. Um, so students don't figure out a pattern and um, also just all the different vowels mixed together. And it looks like our puzzle just needs one more piece. Hey. And we did it, there's the finished product. Great job. Okay, here's the next style of questions. Is tap the sign with the correct answer. Name the picture and find the word. Sky, <laughs> feet, row. Well, notice all of those opportunities to get tricked. So that's just building good skills, problem solving, and chain. All right, and then here is the last style of question. Again, there's five different types of questions and those remain the same with all its different digital word work. But it's okay because the themes are so different and the skills are different. The reason I like the idea of these five different types of questions is five still gives you variety. It's still a lot of fun, but once your students also recognize what the question's asking them, they're not going to need those directions. That's going to help build independence and keep the focus where we want it to. It's on the skill. All right, so it says the correct superhero is going to fly. So we'll have to find the word eat. Here it is. There it goes. Fruit. Tie. Where is it? There it is. Let me get one of these wrong so you can see coat and cot. No big deal. We just try it again. Let's try colt. No big deal. Let's try this one. There we go. Tail. Suit. And we're done. Let's play again. Just kidding. Let's not play again. All right. If you would like to see any of these other games, please let me know. I'd be happy to jump back on video and show you what they look like, give you a closer look. These are going to be available individually, but they'll be in the bundle right away for you. The um, individual games are going to show up throughout the 2021-22 school year. So some of them are going to take a quite a while to get there, um, but the bundle, you'll have them right away. So thank you so much for watching. I hope this was helpful.